So let's address first thing first. Um, let's address Bambi saying Scrappy and Diamond at the BT Awards. Okay. Well, they won together. They went as friends. Diamond can wear what she wants to wear. You know, it might not be what you wanted her to wear, what you would have wear, Bambi, or what I would have wore, okay? But that's her, okay? You know, you were broke before you met my son, okay? You work at the cigar bar. Your mama tried to me a long time ago, and she and I looked up, I, I'm like, Sham, I thought Willie B done broke the f*** out of Lennon Zoo and put some clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> Address that shit. Address that my son blessed you to marry you and to bring you on the show and look what you did. You backstabbed him and you tried to ruin him. Okay? Address that. Because see, what anybody does for me, I'm grateful. Unlike you. Secondly, um, so, um, I wrote some things down, but, um, so, my thing of it all, y'all remember the scene um, last season when we were at the club and Erica Mena and Sierra came at Scrappy for what Bambi said, which was lies, okay? So you got to admit, Bambi never proved that Scrappy cheated. She never did. She just threw the narrative and, and, and women just fell for it. Everybody just fell for it because as a woman, I've been hurt. As a woman, I've been lied to. Okay, I admit, you know, Mama D gonna tell it. But you gotta watch who you follow. You gotta watch who's telling you the lies because they lied and had all these people jumping on, scrappy this, scrappy that. No, Diamond even admitted it. They, they never messed around to after the divorce. Okay, they were clearly divorced. So everything was in Bambi's head. It's always been in Bambi's head. So, um, but Sierra and Erica Miller came at Scrappy like, hoo, hoo, hoo. so I understood when Sierra said that she felt like Bambi did not have her back because she won. Uh, Y'all don't understand. This bitch is just on, came on to be on TV, to get on TV, and she don't give a DAM who she uses to do such. Malaysia just, I don't know. <laughs> Malaysia just ain't woke up to it, but don't worry about it. Mama D has, and, and the rest of the world will when they find out how much she has lied. Okay, the next thing I want to address. Um, and I hate that Sierra went and, and Erica Miller went all out for, for Bam, but when it was um, time for her to reciprocate, right? She couldn't do it because she dang what she there for, okay? That's not what she's on the show for. She's on the, she came on the show to be famous. She married my son to be famous. Okay? Yeah, she was on Basketball Wives, but when, them, when they found out that they had husbands and that bitch was looking, huh, they got rid of that ass. Okay? So, but I hate that my son was the only man. God bless Benzino because he got away. And the other men in Jesus camp that she done slept with. Um, got away, but my son was the only one that did the forbidden fruit. I mean, the for yeah, oh, Jesus. And so from that, y'all, I like to say this as a mom. Women and men, be careful who you bring into your families. Be careful who you fool around with. Because back in the day, if I had an issue with a man or a boy, you know, if I, when I was growing up, my mom and them didn't know nothing about it. They didn't have to deal with my stupidness. They didn't have to deal with my choice of people that I chose to bring in my life. I didn't bring that to them. So, but you know, these these women nowadays, they they look they ain't marrying for, for love. They marry depending on what that man got. And some men, vice versa. Don't let me, you know, just be all down on the women. No, no, no. You know what I'm saying? So another thing I want to address about when scrapping Erica was at the fire pit tonight. Um, that was kind of yeah, weird, Kenneth, for me, but you know, they're friends, and we have said that over and over and over, but people want to make something more of it, and let them do that. Let them do that. I mean, it's, it's your imagination. It's your headspace. You're welcome to it. Um, oh, I, I saw the comments that y'all made when the previews came before we aired tonight. Um, 
Shout out to my sister Donna. It was her debut tonight. Kudos to you, baby sister. Yeah. Um, you know, having a divorce party for my son, for me as a mom, it's like saying you're free, you don't you're not in bondage, you don't have to answer to nobody where you go, where you blah, blah, blah. so because my son, as you all know, he thinks with his heart. You he wears his heart on the sleeve, unfortunately. And a lot of men don't. They don't do that. And um and I know y'all looked at the other days on Scrappy Instagram. He is not well. And uh, you know What's up, what's up guys? Welcome to Web City News Desk. Hope you're having an amazing day. Wherever you're watching us from, thank you so much for taking time to tune into our channel. Welcome to the Web City News Desk. Now, this happy mom, you know, Mama D just took it to her Instagram live, you know, while they were shooting the Love and Hip Hop season. You all know that Love and Hip Hop Atlanta season, you know, is back and, you know, you can stream the episodes because, you know, they are back shooting for a new season. And, you know, when they were on the scene shooting the episode of the Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, you know, Mama D was so mad that she went, you know, live to just address the whole rumors that have been going around, you know, about Scrappy's relationship and everything, you know, and Mama D just came out, you know, to clarify and give a, pl a clear picture on what, you know, is really happening in Scrappy because for the past couple of months now, there have been rumors going on about, you know, Scrappy's relationship and other people suggesting that, you know, maybe he is back with Bambi, other people, you know, saying that he is back with Erica Dixon. But, you know, Scrappy himself has come out to deny severally that he's still single and say that, you know, all these people that he's being accused with, they're just people who he has a close relationship with because both Bambi and Erika Dixon are his baby mamas and he said that, you know, he got love for the two of them because, you know, they take good care of his kids. That's why he loved them so much. But, you know, all these rumors sparkled away back after Louis Scrappy, you know, accompanied Erika Dixon to have a birthday vacation in Hawaii back in August. And, you know, ever since the two were spotted together, you know, rumors have gone on spreading that, you know, maybe the two were trying to rekindle their love and, you know, they were just working on getting back together. And despite the fact that, you know, they were interviewed then, after they came back from the vacation, they denied it. And some weeks later, we saw Erica Dixon also joining Scrappy to celebrate his birthday in Las Vegas. And we both saw how excited, you know, they were to attend the Neo private party together, you know, in Las Vegas. And ever since then, people have been bringing rumors that, you know, Scrappy and Erica Dixon are back together. Maybe they're already married and all that. And Mama D just came out today, you know, to clarify. But according to Mama D, you know, the rumors that, you know, seem to have pissed her off are the rumors that Scrappy and Bambi are getting back together because Mama D has never been a fan of the whole Scrappy and Bambi being together and you all know the kind of relationship that Mama D and Bambi do have because we have seen the two coming out, you know, exchanging words live on their social media platforms and whenever, you know, they get a chance to do an interview, they always talk, you know, negative about each other. And Mamadi just came out to clarify saying that, you know, Scrappy and Bambi can never get back together. And he even went ahead, you know, to give the whole story on how Scrappy and Bambi, you know, they met and, you know, how they came to be after, you know, Scrappy had divorced with Erika Dixon. And according to Mamadi, she believes that, you know, at that time, you know, Scrappy was so heartbroken and he wasn't thinking straight. And that's why, you know, Bambi was able to manipulate him. And according to Mamadi, she believes that, you know, Bambi just was using Scrappy for the fame and she wanted to get on TV. That's why, you know, she was so much on Scrappy's case and that's why the two ended up getting married. And, you know, during their marriage, you know, Mamadi and Bambi have never seen eye to eye. We've seen them, you know, get in so much altercations, even in the public. And Mamadi is always out there, you know, trying to defend Scrappy. Whenever people say anything negative about him, Mamadi is always calling out people, you know, telling them to stop lying on, on his son's name. And, you know, the latest experience when Bambi, you know, was interviewed at 
a certain radio station, you know, and he came, she came out revealing that, you know, she still sings Scrappy, that Scrappy still wants her, and Scrappy's always pulling up at her place, you know, wanting to smash with her. And according to Bambi, you know, she said that, you know, she doesn't have any interest with Scrappy. That's why she's always, you know, turning Scrappy away. And she came out also to reveal that, you know, before Scrappy joined Erika Dixon to her birthday vacation, you know, Scrappy had already asked Bambi for the vacation. But, you know, after Bambi turned Scrappy away is when Scrappy decided, you know, to join Erika Dixon to go to Hawaii together. And uh, according to Mamadi, you know, he came out to say that all these are lies because Mamadi still believes that, you know, without Bambi mentioning Scrappy's name, you know, she can't remain relevant in the industry. That's why she's always, you know, mentioning Scrappy each and every time, including, you know, her latest song that she just released a couple of days ago, you know, calling out Scrappy. Make sure you check out the song on her YouTube page. And Momadi just seemed pissed, pissed off, you know, by all the rumors. People saying that Scrappy and Bambi are getting back together. And she said that, you know, that's something that's never going to happen. And she's not going to allow such a thing as long as, you know, she's still alive. So, guys, tell us your opinion in the comment section about everything that Momadi just said from the video that you just watched. What's your opinion on the whole story? And don't forget to like and share this video so that it can be recommended to a larger audience. And each and every time you feel entertained, always hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much for tuning in, and thank you so much for taking